pass. Ruland gets in, and she scores again. So Ruland has her second. Islanders penetrate, and there's another goal for Radford. Rias got cut off very quickly, though. Trying to find some room. Throws it in behind the net to Carroll. And there's a shot and a score for Enema Rogers. Able to maintain it, Rogers. Boy, a beautiful setup, and Rias has to be a little frustrated. She's missed a couple times, point blank range. And there's the goal. Rias gets it this time. You know, Carroll's so good as the point player in behind the net. It feels great. You know, it's great for the team. Um, this is a very close team, and so they're a team that roots for each other. They want to see that many kids score. We really don't have, you know, that all-star attacker, and that's a great thing for us as coaches because it makes us harder to scout and harder to stop because if you stop one player, we have four or five more that are going to step up and be able to produce as well. We have to stay focused this entire week. I mean, I know it's a long time, but we did it this week, and we came out even stronger. Something that we need to work on is just getting the ground balls, getting low. But as a team, I think we have the focus and the mentality for the next game against Mount St. Mary's. Yeah, um, you know, we're definitely not looking past Mount St. Mary's. It's a good, solid team. And for us, you know, as a new program that has a lot of diversity geographically and how we recruit, it's going to be a big deal for us to go into a Maryland school and beat them because Maryland is really the hotbed of lacrosse. Um, so we, we're really pumped up for that game. Um, as far as Big South goes, we've been focused on Big South since the fall. I mean, April 1st is a date that we've been looking at since September. Uh, we've had it circled on our calendars and we're ready to go. I mean, that's why we train, that's why we condition, that's why we lift and play all these other games is for the Big South. And we haven't won a Big South game yet, and we know that. Um, and that is our number one goal is to really make an impact in the Big South this year.